When Mr. Iwata was appointed president of Nintendo in 2002, although the company was still profitable, it was in decline. GameCube was left in the back from the competition. Data also showed a big decline in interest by the general public. Iwata then issued a year-long research and analysis on the industry resulting that pushing for more advanced hardware was not the most effective direction. Iwata had prior voiced his opinion against the industry's trend to focus on the technology behind the games instead of the games themselves, making them all the more exclusive. He was a firm believer that video games should be accessible and able to be enjoyed by anyone. The first step towards that direction was the Nintendo DS, which became the second best-selling console in history. The next step was the Wii. Even direct competitors praised Iwata for his strategy, allowing video games to spread to massive mainstream status and creating new generations of gamers. On my business card, I am a corporate president. In my mind, I am a game developer. But in my heart, I am a gamer.